Big egg snack for life. It's too short to be serious. Man, what a morning. What a morning. After a pretty good day yesterday. Just kind of had a rough start. So hopefully it goes well for the rest of the day. But who knows what to expect. Anyways, pulled up the Hardee's. Was going to be at work just on time. Do a review, everything like that. And I ended up with the wrong biscuit. But I did get that biscuit for free. Um, so that's plus side. But yeah, I had to go all the way back and tell them and they gave me the right biscuit. So here we are finally doing this review. I'm not going to try and take too long on this because I got work to do. And uh, I don't want to hold y'all up too long. But this is the hot honey chicken biscuit. Doesn't look like a lot of hot honeys on there, but is what it is. Oh yeah, we got the pretty shot here. And yeah. I'm ready to chow down, but before we get there, please subscribe, like, comment, and share, and check out my Instagram, Redneck Snack. So here we go, folks. The hot honey chicken biscuit. I've had the uh, chicken sandwich that's already uploaded. I think I might upload this before I do the upload the waffle one, but I did I did a, a waffle one, and I had a rant for that too. So no rant today. Just a quick side comment, but you know, is what it is. Here we go. I will note this slab of chicken is a bit more hearty, like the, the spices and everything. And then the last time I had it, last time I had it, it was more like their chicken tender, more lightly seasoned. Um, but this is more hearty, so that's interesting. It kind of changes up, depends on which hearty you go to, I guess, and when you go. It's a nice, juicy piece of chicken. Not too thick, but it's pretty enjoyable. I'm not going to try and judge my experience off of... I'm, I'm not going to try and judge this off of my experience. I think it does need some more hot honey. So hot honey is pretty much has got a slight amount of heat, a good amount of sweet, and it's just very enjoyable. They just didn't put enough hot honey on this, which is fine. But out of the three items, I think I really like this one the most. Because their waffle buns are pretty good. They're not bad. They're not terrible. Um, but you just can't beat a buttery biscuit. And like just to pair that with hot honey and chicken, just so good. I just feel like a potato bun, cheese, and bacon is a little bit much on a sandwich, you know, that's featuring this hot honey. And then with the waffle, again, it just comes down to which one's better. And I think I, I rated the waffle better than the sandwich because it was just, it was more simple, but, you know, it was all just more enjoyable. But I think when it comes down to this, I think it's easy to say that the biscuit is the best of the three. I had this experience would I would give this experience particularly an eight and a half. All the ingredients are really good, but again, the downfall here is that it's you know there's not enough. But if they did it perfectly, if they had more you know sauce on there, it would get a ten out of ten. It's just that good. Chicken's good. The biscuit's really good and buttery and made from scratch. I mean, and that's soft. Just imagining how much more flavorful it would be if it had more of it. Man, oh man. But yeah, it's a, it's a delicious biscuit. Highly recommend 
You don't want to miss out on this one. So yeah, that's my review. Simple as it gets. The best of the three items that Hardy has with the hot honey ends up being the biscuit. Which ironically I think is what I ranked the lowest for all the the new chicken items when they first released them. So the irony. Real crazy, ain't it? So yeah, that's my review. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope to see y'all around.